outside and you are stinking hot. You just want to cool down? I'll tell you what you do. You go snowboarding in an indoor snow park. Unbelievable. We're strapped in and um, we're going to hit, hit the slopes. Zip line up here. How good's that? They've got a zip line above a snowfield inside a shopping mall in the desert. Seriously, can it get any weirder? <laughs> I've just come from 43 degrees outside wearing a t-shirt, shorts and double pluggers to wearing a jacket, a ski jacket mind you, ski pants, boots, gloves, beanie and I'm indoors inside a snow park. <laughs> In the desert of all places. This is um, it's gonna bring a tear to my eye. I'd hate to know how much it actually costs to run this every day because the electricity is on day in, day out. Like 24 seven, this place is running just to keep this snow. Surreal, absolutely surreal. So if you look across to the left, there's actually a J bar running up the side there as well. It looks like a J bar or a Pommer. So, um, We'll give that a go. It's actually pretty amazing because where that J bar is, across to the left here, is actually where all the shops are. Um, you actually go up the side and there's a glass panel or glass window that looks into the whole shopping center while you're skiing. This is gonna be fun. Ew. This is epic, seriously. An indoor ski park. Who would have thought of it? Yeah, baby. <laughs> amazing. Absolutely amazing. Well, I'm gonna strap in and let's do this. Alright. Alright. Woo! Oh, this is so good. I'm snowboarding in the desert. Woo! Just ripping around this whip down here. Whoa, it's so icy through that little section there. Gold. That's gold, Jerry. <laughs> so good. Absolutely amazing. Let's ski over to the old T bar and give that a go. I'm gonna warn you, I haven't ridden a T bar or plumber for a long time, so if I stack, please be, please be gentle. I remember being down at Perisher asking for a rocket on one of these. And I hold on to it for a while, like this, and then it shoots off. <laughs> Not like the old days. It's a bit smoother down at Perisher. I love the fact how there's just a shopping center off to my left. Come up here, and then CGI Fridays straight off to the left. People having lunch or dinner, having a brewski while well, I'm here in minus temperatures, snowboarding. Amazing. Here we go. This is the first one. I'm going to fall off one of these. Oh, oh my 
my goodness. And the second one. This one's a bit worse because it goes straight up as well. Oh! oh. Oh, my inner thigh is going to be so sore after this. All my legs were bruised up from yesterday's flow rider. It's a tough job, but someone's got to do it. Taking one for the team. All right. Yeah, baby. Snowboarding in the desert. It doesn't come much sweeter. Where do you go? Traverse across. Up down here, there's a little whip around here. Ew. You know it. From the coming from the far left, coming from the far left up here, you come down and whip across onto the right, and you come straight down. It's probably the longest run you can actually do. <laughs> I don't know if you can see right behind me in the far distance. There's chalets up the top, snow chalets in the desert, and down the bottom, a whole heap of um, restaurants and fine dining. This place is insane. If you can dream about it, I think it happens in Dubai. Oh, there's a zip line. The dude's loving it. Absolutely loving life. Oh, someone's absolutely stacked against the wall down here. You all right? Okay. Wow. Brave girl. Oh. No problem. Wonder if they've got travel insurance. That little girl just came screaming down. Took a beeline. Straight for this fence over here. Absolutely smacked it. A couple of little tears. And then she's back up. Back up, they hit it all over again. You guys get a chance, come to Dubai, chuck it on your bucket list. Even if you only spend a couple of days here on the way to Europe or somewhere, make sure you spend at least two or three days here. There's so much to be done. And um, look, you can spend a whole day here just at this ski park, or you can just spend two hours and then head off and go do something else. Depends how much you want to cram into a day or a couple of days, but definitely worth giving it a go.